I am Dr. D. Ramesh, Head of Department of Pediatrics and Neonatology, Yashoda Hospital, Secunderabad Branch. Jaundice in the newborn called neonatal hyperbilirubinemia. On the second or third day, jaundice is generally detected in newborns, sometimes even at birth. And uh, this jaundice, 99% of them are absolutely safe and they are called neonatal physiological jaundice. 60% of newborn babies who are born normally have uh, physiological jaundice and 80% of preterm children that is those born uh, less than 2.5 kg have physiological jaundice. By pinching the nose and leaving it, that's the easiest way to look for jaundice. If the child is opening the eyes, you can see the sclera where illness is detected and by opening the mouth in the hard palate, the mucous membranes will look yellow. The jaundice it becomes, if seen on the palms and soles, is dangerous because the levels of jaundice are above 15. Normally, 90% of physiological jaundice does not require any treatment. In the old methods, they can show to 5 meter to about for a little to sunlight. But if the jaundice, whatever may be the jaundice, it has to be shown to the pediatrician and they will decide whether it is to be treated or not. So if the jaundice is a little above the physiology, that is if it's above 14 or 15, then the child may require a thing called phototherapy. The child is kept under lights uh, in the newborn unit. But if the jaundice is very high, then it may require more aggressive methods like exchange transfusion, etc. Thank you so much. Like, comment and subscribe for more health updates.